Hi, this is Annette with DigitalPhotographyHowTo.com. Today we are going to learn how to use the clone stamp to get rid of some blemishes on faces. So we're going to go over here and we're going to choose this clone stamp. It says clone stamp tool. Now I'm going to bring this over and you can see the circle. You can see how big it is. Now if you want to change that size, you're going to go up here. You're going to cl click this pull down menu and with blemishes I always choose these airbrush circles rather than these sharp edged circles because this will help it blend in more. Now you can choose different sizes you can see that there's different numbers under if I click that one you can see that that's when I pull it over by her face you can see that's way too big to use to get rid of some spots so I just keep clicking down and moving it over to see how big it is and I think that's going to be the right size right there. So what I'm going to do now is you have to hold down the Alt key on your keyboard to tell the computer what to clone. Okay, so I'm going to get as close to the blemish that I want to get rid of as possible. I'm going to hold down the Alt key and you can see that it turns to a pattern stamp and I'm just going to click with my mouse. Now it has a reference as to what it's going to copy. I'm going to move it right over the blemish and I'm going to hit and it disappears. And then you can see over here that there's just one more right here and you can see that it's darker. So I'm going to come up here to this darker shade on her forehead. And I'm going to hold down the Alt key, click, I'm going to go over the blemish and click again. And there you go, it disappeared. So come back later for some more advanced techniques with our clone stamp.